great day, everybody. Uh, I'm so happy this morning because I was able to find a beautiful place like this. Actually, I am here somewhere at uh, Bulisong, Manhuyud, Negros Oriental. This is a resort of my best friend since high school, uh, Anali Alexander. And this place is called Bulinao. In doing my vlog, uh, especially my first one, I learned from that day that I should uh, visit places to make my vlog inviting. And so here I am again in this another place, somewhere here in Manhuyud. And I am still going to conquer the second, second challenge of making a vlog. Well, again, I'm going to share to you what I've learned in our second uh, session, our second Saturday. And as far as I could still remember, we learned and we focused our discussion so much on the voice. Okay, the type of voices that we need to project in order for us to be an effective uh, voice artist. We should know where our voice should travel, head, throat, the chest, the diaphragm. At first, really, I thought that this whole thing is applicable only to uh, singers. But then again, I a learning from me that it is very also applicable to speaking voice when you do dubbings, right? So, yeah, well, that's one of my learnings. I also learned, of course, about um, the type of pitch, there's the medium, high, very high, and then the low. Well, of course, when you are just going to use our uh, communicative uh, way of speaking, we are using our uh, middle voice like this. But since sometimes being a voice artist, you will be challenged to do some dubbings that should uh, bring out some character. That's why we need to explore on how are we going to really project that kind of voice. By the examples that were shown to us by the Pocholo, by Sir Pocholo, and other voice masters, no? I've learned that uh, it's not easy. This is not really an easy task. But with their expertise shared to us, we are guided eventually and uh, guided towards becoming a voice artist. So thank you for this beautiful learning. Thank you for this another experience in life, a rich experience in life. And uh, I am encouraging my fellow voice mates that we should, uh, we should continue to grow, continue to learn, and uh, let's continue to use our voice to influence many lives and to be an inspiration to them. That's it for my learnings, for my vlog. Once again, this is Claire Benedicto saying, let your voice be heard. Bye!